In this segment, I'd like to tell you a little bit about the QFS Library's event system. It consists of three parts, the event manager, the event monitor, and the event viewer. The event manager uh, allows uh, system events, uh, things that happen in the background, ordinary processing, people entering or exiting, something like that, to be recorded. And to view things that have already happened with the system, you would use the event viewer, which is right here. And right now, we only have one event showing. Uh, it's not been reviewed, and it was simply the user Ray had entered the system. And here's the computer, the program, the process where that took place. And you can see that there are a bunch of filters available uh, to go along with the viewer. Up here are all the items that have taken place in a list. So let's close this out for a minute and generate some events with the event monitor. There they are. And you can see that there were 10 events. Uh, two of them were not just informational. One was a problem. The other was an error. And right from the event monitor, we can go right back into the event viewer. And there they are. They're all listed in sequence that they occurred. And you can see the time is here. Um, so these have none of these have been reviewed yet. Uh, so they're showing. If you want to see all the events that have occurred, reviewed or not, uh, you could click both. And 127 events have occurred recently. And that's just today. So if I wanted to see what happened yesterday, I can click back here on this button next to today. And it's a single day, the 24th. And I can also review a week. Uh, we got 262 uh, all types of events, both reviewed and unreviewed. So let's just see what's happened this week that we haven't reviewed yet. Okay, the number went down a little bit to 224. Let's see the, the unreviewed. Um, well, I guess that was the reviewed. So those are the ones that have been reviewed. It says was reviewed, yes. The unreviewed are here, no. And uh, if you've seen something before and you want to just to clear it out the system so you don't have to uh, view it, uh, you can select a group and click selected and they go away. Uh, or you can simply cl click all and all the events that are in this window will be set to reviewed. And there they are, they're gone now, but they're still in the system. They're just simply marked as was reviewed. So it's just a quick way to see what you've dealt with, what you've already looked at, that sort of thing. Um, the other filters, you can narrow it down to a single program, like we're in demo right now. So these are all demo program. Uh, they all occurred within the demo program right here. Uh, the process, that's the uh, system process, the code that generated them. So if you're having a problem and perhaps in an import process, you'll see that displayed and you'll know that uh, you need to take a look at the data that's coming in. And um, also the user ID and the computer to see if maybe uh, one of the machines has a problem. It can help you to isolate that. All right, so that's the essence of the event uh, system within the library. Close this out. And next, we will take a look at the in-out board.